Hi friends, today I came to us one of the interesting topic as a Microsoft Enterprise Skill Initiative. Okay. many of them nowadays right it's like a trend okay many of the companies asking the who all are completed the microsoft certification exam okay the job description that is our criteria previously they asked me asked us uh, it's like bachelor degree or master degree now the company started asking for uh, who is completed the microsoft certification exam okay so uh, this is a great thing okay uh, if 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 your company having this eligibility to microsoft enterprise skill initiative so there is a lot of benefits for us there for employee okay so first of all i will explain what is uh, enterprise skill initiative okay this is one this is a platform microsoft will provide for the live training you can so if you go here already i wrote the article for this how you can do for the step by step okay microsoft skill initiative okay so here if you go to browser right you have to type esi.microsoft.com okay so uh, this is a way we can check okay there is no other way to check if your company have a eligibility or not okay i don't know actually maybe there is a, some options okay if you so definitely everyone having access this one esi.microsoft.com okay just to type this one okay in your browser afterwards you need to do for the sign in now okay so if you started clicking on the sign in one the sign in now afterwards it started asking for the your uh, work email address like that for example i am giving here js docker this is my uh, blog uh, office 365 right so i am giving this msdevbuild.com okay so now i am clicking as yes, here it's showing for sorry this email address is not eligible for the enterprise skill initiative okay so same like that give your email id okay so it's like uh, your email id like uh, sudhakar at okay your company name okay whatever name it is there dot com or dot in whatever you can give and provide for the next button okay next button if you, if you click means it will populate and show us a uh, provide your uh, uh, user id password like that okay azure id uh, login credential it will ask okay so so what you do you can i already took the uh, screenshot for you all okay so let me explain one by one so if you go after login right it's ask the login okay if you suppose we are giving for the email it is uh, wrong okay if you, are, you cannot use for the gmail and all okay you have to use your work or school account user id password okay so once you are logged in okay uh, so most of the company okay i can tell the company name is like mindry asinche siemens okay those place my uh, my friends are working okay we pro okay those are uh, uh, my friends are tried this one okay uh, this one is was worked okay for them okay definitely it will most of the company fit into that okay you can try and log in on that okay so if after login success right there is a option microsoft learn microsoft virtual days and microsoft delivery courses okay so it will it will show that one by one okay so you can first you can give that your preference okay which time zone you are staying okay uh, based on that the training uh, allocation will happen okay you can if you are registering some of the training okay while searching itself it will show that what is the your local time like that same like that you can provide your country and uh, which language you want prefer language okay if you want english or another any other chinese language like that you can provide the english uh, which language you want Uh, so once you provided this setting screen right afterwards you can tell that expertized okay it's like you are more uh, into that uh, azure architect or artificial intelligence or machine learning or data like that if you next it will ask this is a one okay if you give the preference okay based on that your training everything recommendation the, your home screen setup will happen okay so once done okay uh, the the home screen is like that okay learning partner training okay mostly i not used to this learning partner training because of uh, it's a costly okay individually we need to go and pay the payment based on that they will give for the training okay so this is a exam preparation the exam preparation one the uh, microsoft will guide us okay uh, how we can do for the examination okay uh, 
so this one right uh, it's like uh, uh, they will tell us what are the topic going to come which is section like that so based on that we can do for the it's like a uh, one day session like that they will provide okay uh, they will give the training okay same like that learn uh, learning part okay i i not put full screen here okay so there is a uh, virtual training days is there okay if you provide a virtual training days here uh, if you see here 557 result found there is upcoming training was there okay live training it's a virtual location okay there is a they will say that which language they are going to provide for example for here it's showing for germany okay here it's showing for english okay whichever language you want to take the training you can select the language based on that you can uh, for example you don't know germany so don't choose this one don't register this one okay this training also is like the trainer was well qualified okay the they will train from the microsoft they will come from the microsoft itself okay uh, while taking giving the training right they they won't do for the only for ppt walk through okay so they will give the detailed explanation about the training okay about the topic okay and also they will give for the boot camp okay so they will give assessment you have to complete that assessment it's kind of five days session for example this uh, may second is state is kept it okay same like that 9 to 12 this training will happen like that some training is like two days may 2 2 may 3 like that okay if you attend that training they will that that will be very very benefit for the uh, who all are going to do for the certification okay so next if you if you do right once you've done the training okay next everybody has a questions okay how i can do for the exam for example i am new to this certification okay if you directly go and uh, showing that uh, simulation right the, somebody will get confused how i can choose some place it will come as a dragon trap some place it will come as a choose the best answers okay some place it will come as a single selection like that okay some place we need to answer for two or three questions like that okay so and also right if you do any training or uh, our microsoft learn portal if you do that learn uh, reading that all the articles everything that time you will get little bit confused how the question will frame like that okay so that is a one microsoft going to give the benefit for the this measure uh, mind cup uh, this one okay so here right uh, microsoft will showcase to us if you go to any training okay if you select as this training or this one or this one the minimum cost should be 99 for example is one month is validity one month is 99 it's like three month validity so not nine like that it will be there okay so if, if microsoft is not providing for you so definitely you need to pay for this payment okay so instead of that what you can do that okay uh, we microsoft itself that esi is doing the uh, giving us a best benefit okay so you can click on the practice test okay uh, so if you do the register register is the meaning the exam preparation i'm doing that exam preparation examination everything is coming so if you do the register exam registration we can do there is a, itself okay exam preparation itself okay uh, there is a one day session I told right overall service they will explain this register okay if you do the practice test right it will redirect to the this mic uh, mind cup or website this portal it's it will say that next screen like the do you want to register for like that this 30 days is validity they will give for the two more around 245 questions okay uh, that is very very useful for you okay uh, they will take that all the questions okay uh, you can answer the question for per per uh, examination how it will be 45 question will be there same question will display in that uh, simulation okay once you completed the exam if you restarted again the question will get several okay next again start with the new questions like that okay so 245 question won't start it won't come okay first start it will come for 45 second it will come 45 45 like that okay so here right if you do the register okay mm, sorry practice test if you done the practice test okay uh, it won't be uh, they will give for the answer also okay uh, many people have the question they will only they will give for the question or answer answer like that they will give for answer and also they will give for the explanation of the the topic okay why the answer is correct like that that is very very interesting okay after your training what is the steps you need to follow you need to schedule the examination 
you need to do for the practice exam sorry you need to do for the training you need to learn yourself okay do for the, all the boot camp everything then you can do for this practice test okay once you done the practice test definitely you can throw as a microsoft certification also okay so then you can do that okay how you can do for the microsoft certification okay this is a one microsoft developer if you want to select for solution architect okay we can select as a solution architect okay solution architect which which one you want to do is like microsoft certified azure sap workload specialist okay so if you see here okay one second see here okay I am selecting is my location is like a Malaysia. Okay, here it will show as a night. So don't worry. Okay, once you schedule the exam, okay, we can link your corporate account. Okay, schedule like exam. Okay, here right. Uh, so don't log in with your corporate account. Okay, in the, while scheduling the exam, please use your personal account. Okay, personal Gmail ID like that. Okay, once you provided, make sure the, your uh, your detail is here. It is correct or not like that. Okay, here this link account is there. Okay, initially it won't be display here. If suppose if it is display, you can click on this link account and provide your uh, company email ID. Okay, whichever ID you mention. Okay, company ID you can uh, provide here. If it is not, you can give profile only personal. Okay, verify all the detail is correct or not. Once profile is correct, you can click on OK, continue. Okay, here there is an option for enter email ID, check for the discount. Okay, here you can give for sir, your uh, uh, company email ID, okay, ESI portal, whatever email ID you give, same email ID you can give here and check the check eligibility. So, if you provide the check eligibility, okay, uh, the your uh, my uh, for example this is my examination okay so my company name here it's showing okay it's like a claim like that if you say that i am claim claimed like that okay so i am scheduling the exam if you already linking the that linking your account definitely your company name will come here so if it is not come definitely you need to do for the check eligibility i am doing for the schedule exam So here right we can check that uh, online at my home office okay so let me show here and this they are saying that steps what are the steps you need to follow and I am clicking on the next so what is the language you are looking for prepared language for the exam okay we don't know any language so that I am mentioning here is English let me click on next So here it's showing for the plan uh, planning for admission to Microsoft Azure for SAP workload. The price is uh, 4,800 rupees in INR it's showing. Okay, I will say that next. The candidate currently has an open registration for this exam. So this examination already I selected so that uh, it's showing already a registration is there like that okay uh, so let me go with some other examination we'll select so I'm only two languages supported english and japanese and i'm selecting for english so here we will accept okay Def I, I know this examination i not done anything any mouse go that I am selecting, 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 accept all the things you can accept and agree. Which language you are, uh, so that also now I can select English. So, this is uh, my time zone, okay. Yes, that is correct. Okay, we can pick the date, okay. Which date I am going to do the examination, okay. So I am not going to schedule, okay, just for a demo purpose, we are, I am selecting and showing you all, okay, 12 hours format, best you can select as a 12 hours format, sometimes people will select a 24 hours, by mistake they will set as a uh, late night like that, okay, set as a morning time and uh, I can choose that uh, 7, 7 o'clock in Malaysian time. 
okay if you go here okay i can see that 4800 rupees in inr okay if we come here a discount was the 4800 okay here estimate price is zero rupees no need to pay any payment okay just clicking on the placing to checkout okay once you placing the checkout the exam will schedule okay so once exam is scheduled you can uh, uh, log in with this portal for uh, 30 minutes before okay if you are logging 30 minutes for example check-in time is uh, 6 30 okay start time is 7 6 30 if you do they will do for the verification your uh, id card everything so once done the verification okay uh, once done the verification they will ask you to start the exam okay so while doing the exam you cannot close your eyes and uh, something you cannot wear the headset and all okay so you can watch uh, front of the screen and you need to do for the examination okay so another thing was uh, so this examination suppose you can think about this exam uh, uh, is you failed okay this exam you are not done good okay the mark is less than 700 700 okay so you can do for the rest uh, re retest also okay immediate uh, restart you can, uh, immediately you can schedule one more uh, day okay same examination you can try for that another shot as well okay i hope this uh, one it's more interesting for you okay uh, more useful also okay so, so some of the my friends don't know about this one okay not only friends whenever i am going to take the some events and that they may not aware about this uh, one okay so that uh, I thought to write for article and uh, share this one okay you can also follow my article uh, for uh, reading do for the step by step okay here, here I gave for the very detailed uh, explanation okay maybe you can check out and share your feedback as well I hope so this uh, session uh, very good for you all okay thank you bye